Come in. Hi, Putin. What's on the mind? I noticed that in the real world, it is starting to get nicer. Well, it is March after all and spring is coming up, and before you know it, it will be summer, and as you can see I have my sandals on, so I am one step ahead in preparing for the inevitable hot weather. The land of Yon's weather seems to be nice all year round, I mean when was the last time we ever saw it rain? Never. And somehow we don't even have droughts. But anything is possible in the land of Yon after all. It sure is Holly. Wait a second, why are you holding a laptop? Oh, the reason why I came into your room in the first place is because I was going to show you the price of the permanent version of Vyond. I don't know. Eddie keeps saying it is quite expensive and I might have a heart attack if I saw the actual price. See for yourself. $999 a year. You have got to be having a laugh if you think I'm going to pay that much for a subscription for a simple drag and drop video making channel. I can buy a car or a van or maybe even a house for that price. Yes, you can get the cheapest subscription but even that costs $299 a year, and that equates to £226 in the UK currency. With that amount of money I'd rather buy a secondhand PS4 Pro. Okay, this is even more expensive, but only buy £9. If you think I'm going to spend that much money on a Vyond subscription, you have another thing coming. I wasn't asking you to buy it for me, I was just simply showing you the prices. I know, but I just can't get over the fact it costs that much. What happened to the good old days when it cost like $50 a year? That was a more reasonable price and I would be more than willing to pay for it. But now they expect you to pay about 60 times that much. I bet the CEO of Vion must have been on crack or something. Well, what you've got to realize is, Viand isn't really for making grounded videos. It is really meant for business related stuff. Yes. I am very aware of that. But you've got to admit it is severely overpriced for what it is. With those prices you might as well just use Plotagon instead. Okay, the Plotagon business subscription is more expensive than the cheapest Vion subscription, but as you can see, the cheapest one here is the academic one, but I think that only works if you have an academic email. With a normal email you can get the discounted one for $70, which is a reasonable price for what Plotagon is. I'll probably make a one-off Plotagon video at some point. I heard that their free trials are longer than Vyond's, and a lot of Vyond users also make Plotagon videos in addition to their usual Vyond videos. That sounds like a good idea. But just be thankful I can use temporary emails, if it weren't for them, we wouldn't be here right now. Good point. Is everything okay in here? Yes Travis. I just flipped out over the price of Vyond. Tell me about it. Even the cheapest subscription is as overpriced as balls. I know Vyond is only meant for businesses but come on. Not even businesses should have to pay that much for what Vyond is. You know what? That's it. I am going to sue Vyond for its absurd prices. Now if you excuse me, I have a lawyer's office to attend to. Ha, huh, good luck with that. Please note that I am not worried about the free trial watermark, nor the low quality. But I strongly believe that Vyond is severely overpriced and they should lower the prices with immediate effect. But on the plus side, I have some exciting news. The next video will reveal the members of a new troublemaking group called the Legion of Malak. The reason why they are called the Legion of Malak is because Malak is the name of their leader. Malak's name is Callum spelt backwards, and he will be a super soldier who is created in a lab. Hi, I'm Malak. I am the evil clone of Callum Rockley. My origin story will be a special episode which will be created after the next video. It will also feature the origin of my gang who will be the nemesis group to the cult of the white dragon. My voice will be Alan. The reason I chose the Alan voice is because there is something dark and sinister about it. Lizard will also be a member of the Legion of Muluk. He appeared in the last video where he attacked a royal guard. The rest of the members however will be revealed in the next video, and will make their canon appearance in the video after that. And in the same video, there will be a new member of the cult of the white dragon.
I won't tell you his name, but I'll give you a hint. He is a boy who drives a time traveling car in order to get back to the future. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, comment like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. This is Callum Rockley signing off.